and we're picking up where I left off which is continuing the search for the keepers trials which is going to lead me where exactly let's find out let, let me remind myself quests please a final location the second trial I still have the, the daily increase to worry about like three of them sweeping the competition but that's yeah another thing and the demi guys statues we'll see Hey, we got. Let's continue where we left off, unless back out. Let me double check if there are no quests present on the world map. Oh, I can actually really. I didn't. I wasn't actually sure what I can do that. So let's see what we actually have. Like how many locations? Clagmar Coast, Manor Cape, Crackcroft Crack Shire, <laughs> hard to read, Marunwim Lake, Poitzar Coast, there's a coastal cavern, South Sea Bog, that's a small area, Hogwarts Valley, Feldcroft region, the mountain doesn't uh, seem to be a part of this. South Hogwarts region, North Hogwarts region, Forbidden Forest. I always imagine the Forbidden Forest would be a lot bigger, unless it still runs to the uh, <clears throat> what's the word? West. Yeah. Hogsmeade Valley and North North Ford Bog. Not like East for the bog? I mean South Sea Bog. Southern Sea Bog and North Fort Bog. Yeah, regardless. I don't see like any marks lead me, okay. On a quest area. And I am aware of the sweeping the competition. Aside of that, there is nothing else. So let's continue what we, what we were doing back on the path. Professor Fig is in the map chamber. I should speak to him about the secret events. Recent events. Why did I say secret? I mean, they are technically secret for a lot of people. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot about another thing. How is my inventory doing? Because I probably need to sell a bunch of stuff. Not the inventory, the gear. 19 and 28. Yeah, I definitely need to. So yeah, two things. Again, map. First of all, the secret room, because I don't remember had I dealt with uh, identifying the unidentified items in my inventory. And outside of that, back to Hogsmeade to sell them and then talk to Professor Fig. Yeah, that's a plan. I still haven't unlocked this part of the uh, animal menagerie. <laughs> there we go. Deek, where you at? Hard to say, but yeah, as long as I'm here I can pick up the Dittany a bit. Can I get like some with the potions? How am I doing the potions? Hold on. I have no more chomping cabbages. I have no mandrakes. I have one invisibility potion. One thunder brew. Uh, none of the focus potions. Four maxima potions. And one Edoras. Like three for each, like hmm. What is the Edoras problem with drinkers uh defense by covering them with a durable rocky skin? I mean I can make some of them because it's Moongrofer and Ashwander eggs. 
I have a bunch of those items. I think we got Edra's potion. Nah, whatever, I don't need it. Ah, there we go. Hmm, I do have good to identify. The embossed tail coat. That's the one that I needed to check. And how does the embossed tail coat look? That's only one way to find out. Hmm, this one's better than the one I'm wearing currently. Oh, both of them are the same. This one is increases venom's tentacular damage, and this one increases damage with Crucio. So yeah, I prefer to go with this one. Hmm, kind of cool. Not very student-like, but kind of cool. A very sophisticated Gadad. Regardless, but let's shift it to a proper student attire. I don't want to get in trouble with the uh, professors for not wearing the proper attire. I mean, kind of sort of a boarding school. A uniform applies. By Merlin's beard. Okay. And now... I can absolutely go to Hogsmeade. And sell a couple of stuff, uh, items. And even buy a couple of items too. Should I? Nah, not yet. We'll see. And again, I can see another upgrade to my... Well, it was a Vivarium, right? A word I don't usually use that often. A Vivarium. Who cares? Ah. Horse spells can be assigned. Remember to spend your talent points. Yeah, I'll get to it uh, once I learn the Bombarda. As I know I can learn it. I'm waiting and who's gonna learn, teach it to me? Not certain. Taking bets. Who do you think would teach me Bombarda? I mean, I remember Professor Fig using Bombarda in the beginning. But would I actually... Because he also used Levioso. But I learned Levioso from Professor Hackett. I'm gonna say Professor Bombarda. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go Professor Garlic. <laughs> Imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Oh, I don't know, Ignatia. Now that I actually have access to a flying mount and a broomstick, hmm, I guess it is efficient. But is it fun? It should be fun and efficient. I'm guessing some people might enjoy being tickled with green flames, but. I'm not one of them. Not a pyromaniac. Before you ask, I'm all out of the new socks, so if your feet are smelly, you'll have to work it out for yourself. I'll take a shower, thank you very much. Or a bath, regardless. So, now that these, this I can sell, absolutely. This I will not. This goes to the chopping block. So does this, these gloves, these, this garb, this scarf, not this robe, but these gloves, these glasses, spectacles, and this tailcoat. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Hmm. Keep that in mind. I have none. Okay. Now that that's now that that's done, we we'll get it. We are having Halloween themed. Oh, it looks cool in the middle of the night. I actually never actually watched. Am I using the word actually? Actually, I think I am using the word actually. So actually, I'm gonna stop saying actually at this point. So many pumpkins. What is flying over there? Bats? Are those magical bats? Are those real bats? Are those real magical bats? Genuine magical bats! It's always fun to look at a Halloween scenery during a... Well, after dark. Some more bats. 
Like Hogsmeade looks really nice with all those decorations. I should be like check the entire place. Because we have the tree. Those yeah, lanterns hanging all around about. There are owls. The design of this house is weird. What is this? Is it an allery? Oh, that's the post office. Okay, that makes sense. Hmm. So many, so many cool decorations. Still in a Halloween spirit. And it's June! Hello. The cat just appeared out of nowhere. A magic! Everything, if, I'm just gonna call it, if anything looks weird in this game, it's magic, regardless if it's a glitch or anything else. Magic. That's like the simplest way that you can excuse this game for any particular thing that may uh, give you a certain pause from a technical standpoint. Things floating about? Magic. My character glitching through floor? Magic. Regardless. Okay, talk to Professor Fig. Talk to Professor Fig. Talk to Professor Fig. Why did I repeat it three times? I have no bloody idea. Okay, here we go. It's in the map room, so I need to go to the secret rooms. Secret rooms. And travel to the map chamber. Because that's the uh, second to last a uh, mission in the list of progression before I get to deal with you know which one the trial the trial the, the yeah the witch trial I mean the uh, keeper trial you know because I decided to play Quidditch and I'm gonna play as the keeper So Ron can read legends about me and yeah, then be inspired to be a keeper himself 100 years from now. My mode is lacking in kind of like superficial, superficial references. It's actually interesting. Hmm. What is interesting, you might want to ask? Well, I just had a weird thought in my head because I think like Ignatia was a witch before Hogwarts was established, right? I don't know for how long the flu part has been in existence. I'm back! Professors? Good to see you. You would uh, be wise not to underestimate this student. Their aptitude for magic is beyond anything I've ever seen. And I've been teaching a long time. It is a joy to have such a student. It can be. Hmm. You know something, don't you? What did uh, Isadora do? Because I'm still expecting there her to do are. something bad. From what I've learned from her, she may have a good intention, but she definitely did something extremely bad. Professors? I've received your owl. I was able to speak with Lord Gok, the goblin I mentioned before. What did you learn? He and Ranrock were close once, but they had a falling out. You believe he can be trusted? I'm not sure. Yeah, actually, it's difficult to say. He seemed trustworthy. Difficult to know, really. But Sirona Ryan trusts him. Well, that's something, I suppose. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? I retrieved a stolen helm. He hopes to return to Ranrock in order to regain his confidence. Yes. You have been busy. Indeed. Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. Lord Gok did mention that Ranrock is searching for something, but he couldn't say what. Perhaps that helm will yield some answers. Perhaps. Ranrock is searching for something. I feared as much. What do you know, Professor? I've unusual amount of activity. Goblins and wizards, I surmise. When visiting my portrait at my castle. Oh, I know what that is. Castle. My former residence, yes. That castle is also the location of your next trial. What fun! 
And you didn't see anything? You didn't see anything? Speak with anyone? I did not. In fact, I did not make myself known. I only recently returned there and did not recognize nor trust anyone that I heard. I stayed out of sight so as not to tempt my portrait's destruction. And that should bring the question because I didn't think it ever was explained. So, is the. Uh, I don't think I actually will get into it, but it kind of puzzles, uh, boggles the mind of me. There are a lot of portraits of wizards, I presume. And from what I can tell, like he can travel between portraits freely, the portraits of himself. But how does that work? Because if he's here, does that mean that every other portrait of him in the world is empty? And that's really problematic because they, yeah, they, they're printing. I don't even know how, how it means when you print like the uh, pictures or photographs or etc. That they work on the same basis, or do portraits have a different connection than let's say like uh, the cards from uh, Chocolate Frogs? That's interesting because if that's the case, does it mean that there's only one tiny Dumbledore, for instance, traveling between every single card of the Wizarding uh, World Chocolate Frogs, the collectible cards? I also want to say about someone Phoenix. And if they, if they can actually travel to a certain point, like, that is actually an extremely useful spying technique. Let's say there's a particular like dark wizard or something like because I think I, I'm almost certain that there's a card of Salazar Slifer and said like that. I haven't seen any of the portraits of the original founders, the four, but how does it work? Like if we have the card of Salazar Slytherin and someone has a card of Salazar Slytherin in his collection, does it mean that Salazar Slytherin can just jump from every depiction that is supposed to be of him? And technically give information on the movements, like for instance, Lord Voldemort. Yeah, like let's assume that Lord Voldemort had a portrait of Salazar Slytherin. And I'm assuming that a lot of wizards collect the, the trading cards. So basically, on that basis, like Salazar Slytherin could be helping Lord Voldemort with his quest, but just giving him information if he would be willing to help Lord Voldemort. Tom Riddle. There's an yeah, uh, whatever, never mind. So, uh, regardless, let's have some bad news. I'm sorry to tell you that Victor Rookwood, evidently your descendant, is a dark wizard in league with Ranrock. My descendant? A dark wizard? I'm afraid we've no time to waste. Hmm. Despite the obstacles that clearly await you, you must get to Rookwood Castle immediately. Not only is it the location of the next trial, it is home to a source of power that would be devastating in the wrong hands. I do wish we had the luxury of time. However, I do not doubt your abilities. No, oh, Find my portrait there as soon as you can. Very well, sir. I'm on my way. Yes. Best of luck. That's all? Great. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. No, oh, you come to Professor. Fun. Quest complete. Back on the path. That completes the quest. That's actually kind of interesting because I am almost certain that Percival is a Slytherin. And uh, somehow I think this guy is a Gryffindor. And yes, I'm basing this on the colors of the robes. Technically. Actually, means like, or is he? Like, let's see on the backgrounds. The background actually tell me a lot about what's going to be happening. Like, for instance, Professor Rackham. Where is he standing? Like, what is his location? What did you say? There's a wall. I think there's a sculpture. Some sort of library. I think he's in the study because I can see a desk with some skulls and the uh, and even what, what the thing is called. But 
this is an also like a study room so this is weird but there's a little bit of blue so it's like the Ravenclaw there's green in the background so maybe he is a Slytherin I doubt it but I mean, he doesn't talk like a Slytherin it's like the, the comments I mean they are interesting Slytherins like for instance like Ominous Gaunt Ominous Gaunt it said Ominous instead of Ominous I missed to I uh, screwed up his name well regardless let's move what's here I don't actually check this place fully some water some lights I really do love this map though this map looks great I wonder if I would be able to just break through the uh, glass can I just walk as a giant <laughs> hard to say well anyway let's uh, move fast travel into the world map where precisely oh over here I have been here before well then I am going to take a longer approach Feldcroft Catacomb or well, maybe not I mean yeah I guess Feldcroft South Feldcroft and Feldcroft Catacomb yeah let's unlock every oh no so there's the uh, where is that North Feldcroft it's still a part of Feldcroft kind of but I can also get there I'm assuming from West Hogwarts Valley like a around a road around this mountain whatever it is I'm gonna speak with Imelda later on there's an ancient magic hotspot here so yeah no time to lose McDonald travel when I get myself full into my Britishness which doesn't exist, I'm assuming, but yeah. <laughs> Cultural appropriation. That's my uh, whole shtick, basically. Sue me. Brooms are most effective near the ground, but Hawksmith Broom Vendor believes he might have a way around this limitation. Huh. That is interesting. The brooms are most effective in the ground. So it means is that like a game mechanic thing that the brooms are better off when I fly closer to the ground and mounts are better when I fly higher. It's right out of a storybook. Did you say that before? Hmm. Regardless, I want to get here. Gonna be a short route. Hmm, and a high one as well. I wasn't able to get into this house, was I? Because yeah, it's a level two lock. Right, I don't want to jump hoops or walls. Follow the butterfly, I guess. Why is there a palisade here? That's what it's called, right? Against goblins? It's not a very good one, though. There are so for a second I thought he said I did a bed in a bit of troll duty. It's a patrol duty, okay. Well you may believe that, but I do believe that Mr. Rockwood Rockwood? Rockwood believes otherwise. 
I really want like every time that he actually learns. The young student did what? He beat another 100 of my luckies. Okay, 100 is a little bit of a hyperbole. But 10, like easily. That's an interesting route. Route. Is that a... Hmm. Is that extremely vivid green? What say your birds with a lemon? Nice to see you here. Ah, isn't the sea air refreshing? It always is, Ignatia. It's good to see you wherever. Taking in the sea breeze. I thought you knew. Ah, the British coast. How droll. <laughs> nah, I love it. It's gonna be quite chilly in here, as it's autumn. But regardless, okay. I can't deal with the trial of Merlin because I am lacking in the aspect of middleweed. I forget the name. It's a weed. Unimportant. Okay, but I can deal with the ancient hotspot. As long as I'm here, yeah. I'm going to take a nice walk around. That is a countryside. A Scottish countryside. I don't remember thinking, did that game uh, like absolutely uh, inferred in me like, the sense that, oh yeah, Hogwarts is in Scotland. I wasn't aware of that before. I would really like want to take like one of those bovines back of myself so my hippogriffs can eat it. <laughs> oh look, red barrels. That's a weird effect when she's actually okay. Move away. Yeah, there's a second before like the Fire starts. And, oh, a troll. Two trolls. Where is the spell I'm looking for? Didn't I actually... Magic. Hmm. Some gold. Rebellion. Ooh, there's a. It's a Merlin Merlin trial thing, isn't it? Horcrumps are extremely prominent around here. Hold on a second. Yeah, that's the Merlin trial. I'm hearing whispers. Rebellion. What is that? <coughs> Underground? Guess not. Hmm. So how does one open it? A 
Okay, that opened something. The question is, where is... Okay, there's a chest. It's just there. Hmm. Being blind. How can I pinpoint the location of the magic symbols? Is that another one? No, it's not. Okay, let's shift the spell. Make it clear. Shift the spell. Incendio. Currently track. What was it? Revelio. Ah, this one. I've only done this before. I mean, uh, not before, but. Oh, there it is. Hello. Why are you so far away? Yeah. Going to fly. Can I climb, maybe? Regardless. I'm only using a broom because it's a lot easier to maneuver. I can land here? Up here. Yeah, this works. I forget, what one, which one was this? Oh, chest. Hmm. Challenge unlocked. Landing platform. One out of two. Uh. Okay. That was easy. So there's a platform which, on which I can land a broom, I'm guessing, or something other than that. Going down. <laughs> Yay. Oops. What's this? Oh. Revelio. Accio. Incendio. Dwarf. Revelio. Is it like another? That'd be quite far. I'm not certain where is the uh wait is it here? Rebellion. Like the distance between the uh, magic hotspot and the magical uh whispers or whatever they are called, tendrils, etc. Does it show me the way? Not particularly. Hmm. This is weird. Shut up. Hmm. 
Do you think, could they be really? Where the trolls are? Where the wild things are? I should uh, investigate. No, only if I should. Hmm. Hard to say. I could try expect uh, not expect a patron. Flip a troll's club onto its face. Complete the battle without using a wooden world potion. I don't know how. Uh, what was the. Uh, Hold on, because I need to get into my uh, my spells again. Because where is it? At my level? Talents inventory collection? Enemies? No. Where are the spells? One handles? No. Trades? Tools? I'm blind. Conjurations, appearances, the value of page images, apples, quests, map, challenges, talents, inventory. Where do they, they read the description of those? Should be the collection, right? Trades, tools, enemies. No, that's not the one. Okay, I'm almost done with all the magical creatures. I forgot about that. But your yeah, enemies. Tools, nope. Trades, nope. Not the one hammers, that's definitely it. Changes map, quest, talents, inventory, quest, outpost map, gear. Where's Flipendo? Inventory, and it counts. Not inventory, not talents, I forget about everything. Core. Ah, now I remember. Enemies. That's why I read it. It was the description of a spell, the description of the enemy. Hitting a tool of its own boulder will catch it off guard and make it more vulnerable to follow-up attacks. After Troll slams its club on the ground with both hands, flipping it up with a flipendo. So it's, uh, yeah, slam the ground with both hands, and then you should be extremely quick to use flipendo on this one. Okay. I can do that. I can absolutely do that. Just that, okay, flipendo is the purple one. So swap it to here. I'm gonna take the cryo. And Defendo. Now the question is, would I be able to? Huh. Let's see if it works. Now that w I guess it worked. Ah, wrong, wrong, wrong troll. Got him! Wrong one. Oops. What's its level? Ha, <laughs> he's stuck. Oops. Oh, 
Why do they have a lot of health? Hmm, didn't work. Two big trolls. I can do this all day. Haha, <laughs> wham. It's kind of fun. Two trolls against me. Ow, okay. It's a little bit too fast. Whoops! Hey, stop painting yourself! Whoa! Didn't work. Wham! And fun. Chill. Shatter. <laughs> and I didn't even have to use uh, troll bogies. Ew. The things I do for experience. <laughs> now there's a... What is this? Okay, there's the... Uh... Oh! I know what this is. Wrong, wrong uh, button. I need Accio. Bingo. Magic power never runs out. Now what? Revelio. Incendio? Incendio. Revelio. Hmm. Guess not. Weird. What's through here? Revelio. Why was I able to destroy that? I have no idea. Oh, there it is. So I did have to beat the trolls. It's not blood. It is blood. This game is if not PG. You know. Harry Potter for kids. That wasn't too hard. I mean, I guess beating two trolls, seeing a dead uh, bovine, yeah. Well, that was fun. I killed trolls. Got the call the species. I wonder what's uh, Newt's commander's uh, approach to trolls. Revelio. Okay, this is a thing that I'm not even certain. 
because I placed it and now it returned. Hmm. What the heck? Unless it opens the uh, passage down, yeah. I fall down. Oh, so there was something that I noticed, something. Okay, that did unlock the passage, technically. Rebellion. And in the other cave there are refined dueling gloves. That was bloody useless. I guess. It's never useless to just do a little bit of exploration. Taking it all in. Somebody set a fire in here. It's a really magical fire because it doesn't seem to go out. Okay, regardless. What's next on the agenda on the map? I've dealt with the uh, magical mystery cure. Yeah. Let's play with another flu powder. I'm flying, I'm flying. Enjoy suffering, do you? No, I enjoy flying. That's what I enjoy. Tree. Defeat and then move Patricus to tell us. Hmm? Hold it, what was that? Oh. Revelio. Okay, I know it's there. I need... I have also for that. I think I'm gonna cut them. And maybe this one. Not particularly. Revelio. Wonder who lives here. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Indeed. Okay, I want to get this thing covered. I can absolutely, yeah, set myself to this place. It's not far. Depending on whether to follow the road or just go off road. Not far, just kind of high. Hmm. Rookwood Castle. Ah, wouldn't mind a plum job at Gringotts. Suit me sitting around all day. Mind you, I suppose it could get a bit boring. You think? Or run rock ro loyalists. Oh, the 
this day has gone on too long. You think? Levity to enemies simultaneously. Those my family work in the mines. <laughs> Why don't you come up here and fight me? <laughs> That was actually a wrong one. Never mind. You arrogant child. How childish. Bingo. Where? Maybe. Maybe I am. Well. That was fun. Regardless. Indeed, it was quite amusing. Exhilarating, might one even say. I just say one might even say. Well, shall we wait? We shall.